Yeah. What is happening? Yeah. Ah, that's me, right? So. Like Rick told me in the, in the car right here. We can do this as long as James Chen is alive. <laughs> you're, you're the lifeblood of the FGC, James. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna be turning to dust anytime <laughs> soon. Don't do it, man. Not, we, we not, need because, you. not because of the snap either, dude. So. <laughs> Alright, they're on the Galleon. I didn't see who they picked, but I'm going to assume that Diddy Mokoff is going with Shizu. Yeah. He and, uh, might go go a little wild and pick Kazuki, though. He does really like that character. And Amaterasu score, probably going to stick with the Haomaru. How is one of those characters that after the patch, people are like, oh, how's dead? How's, how's gone? How's, he's clearly he's not dead or gone. This character is still very strong. Yeah, I'm still curious right now because I feel like a lot of the characters here are pretty good. I'm, I'm waiting to see if someone can maximize characters like Wampu or Basara and stuff like that. So. I, dude, I, I think both those characters are pretty strong. Yeah, because Kazuki and Shizumaru are obviously very good right from the get-go, right? right out of the gate. Right now, Judy Mokoff, okay. Like I said, Judy Mokoff and Ronan Rumble, he's willing to throw uppercuts crazy in crazy situations. So, oh wow, what for the deflect. And look at this, Judy Mokoff has just run into so many little yeah, hits. Yeah, he's trying so hard to get in, but yeah. Scores is throwing out that well, CMB. There you go, run up uppercut. Like I said, he's willing to do it. Yeah, but I mean, that was kind of a situation where he wasn't going to make his opponent waste the SSF. Right. So, kind of like, why? Right? He's not going to get much from the other side. There is, that is definitely the Farofa uppercut right there from Judy Mokoff. Oh, wow. Did, was he trying to throw the card mode? I don't, okay, I don't know. Maybe he went for the uppercut, but missed the input. Either way, Diddy Mokov looks really off balance right now. He seems like he's trying to press. The scores is not yeah. happening. Scores doing a good job keeping him out right now. I like the hop over the dead body there. Yeah, look at this. Down to very, very little life right now. Oh, well, here we go. Opportunity, no. Yeah, that's going to do it. Oh, actually, oh, yeah, yeah he had the burst still. Oh, is he going to counter this? No, he's going to do it. Yeah, he's going to do the wow. round, too. Wow. Score choosing to sacrifice that round, thinking he'll have a better chance winning next round. With, I mean, he wanted his meter, right? Right, with having the resources versus a resourceless Didi Mokab. I think that's risky. I think it's smart. I agree with score. I would have done the same. I probably would have let the round go. Oh, oh my God, goodness. Oh, but wait a minute. <laughs> I got my own jump heavy slash. All right, Bucko. Th the crazy thing about Shizumaru is I don't even know if it's... Uh-oh. Okay, yeah, burst there. Oh, oh no. He threw too early. He missed. Not this time. Gets the uppercut. Oh, tried to bait off the Isen. Yep. Oh, 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 he, he went for it. He, he went for it, James. And you talked about those crazy uppercuts, those wild uppercuts. That was one that worked out for him. That was madness. He just went for it, and sure enough, it worked. Didi Mokop I, I, I have to one. assume that he oh, thought that score would react with the Isen, right? Okay. So he's like, the only way I'm going to go through this Isen is with an uppercut. Right. But <laughs> it worked out. Just, punished. <laughs> just straight up punished. Oh, he missed the throw. It's too early. Here we go, getting hit by the uppercut. Mm. Yep, going to the uppercut. So tying it up in life here. Oh yeah! Oof. There so we much go. for that. That didn't last very long. Yeah, that'll connect. He's into weapon flipping technique. Now chip him out. That's all you have to do is chip him out. Why? Yeah! Yeah! Diddy Mo Kong! Pick up your weapon! Go How ahead! Dare Pick you. up your weapon! How dare you! Oh! Yeah, yeah, exactly. He had to. He had to. And right back. He doesn't want to deal with it. You're not going to take my weapon from me. Yep, off the wall floats. And yeah, no more. Oh! That's, that's not going to do too much, yeah, it's though. Yeah, going to be a little bit of chunk right there. You can do a little damage, and, and that's okay. Go uppercut. Nice backdash to get away from there and get some good damage. 
Oof. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Diddy Mokok going up 2 0 on score. And, and it's just the craziest thing about that is like Shizumaru, like that jumping C, I feel like is also just faster than the other jumping Cs in the game. I'd have to look at the frame data the for best. that. It's the best jump yeah. button. I love that button. I'm sure you do. I don't play Shizumaru, I play jump C. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> So, sitting back there. Oh, oh and another one. Okay, he's yeah, not he's gonna keep there. it. He's gonna keep yeah, it. Yeah, I, I, I like that decision to save very it for later. Early, very early in the match. Yeah, it might not be worth it just yet. That way, if Hamaru ever whips an uppercut or makes any silly mistakes, he's gonna have the SSM option. <laughs> Going for another deflect because it, now if he does it, he'll win the round. <laughs> Yeah, he's just, just throwing him out yeah, there. He's just doing a bunch of deflect. Good ooch! Ouch. Level four. Okay. Oh, no. for it, yeah. Punish time. Uh, he didn't not get the enough. punish yeah, he yeah, wanted. Yeah, yeah he, he, he definitely wanted the run key first. Ah, uh, but the score did not know what side he was going to be on again. Yeah, with a little that mini mix-up. And just like that, Diddy Mokoff is on match point. This is crazy. One round away. Diddy Mokoff. He's so smart as a fighting game player. Score, of course, also very, very strong as well. I wouldn't count him out just... Oh, there it is! He can have the burst. Yeah, yep. He, he had, had no choice. Yeah, he had no, no choice. choice. And you know what? You're okay with this as Diddy Yeah, you yeah, know? for sure. For sure. You have no more recesses. We're coming into this last round. I have everything. And he's already sitting on Rage, too. So if he gets an early hit, he's going to take that weapon away immediately. Okay, here we go. Good lead right now for score. Not a huge lead, but that just puts pressure. Oh, he burst right away. Oh, he's, he's gonna, gonna take the weapon. weapon. Yeah. He's gonna take the weapon. And a good chunk of damage as well. Yeah. <laughs> Mokok, I can hear cheering in the background over there. <laughs> oh, oh no! Oh, oh but he no. missed the SSM. Yeah. <laughs> You know what? That makes me feel so much better when a player like Score misses that. <laughs> makes me feel like not an idiot when I miss it. Did he still have it though? <laughs> Score's not using SSM. Oh, no. you're right. He just missed yeah, it. Yeah, he just oh, missed the that input. Is huge. He just missed the input. It happens to, to the best of us, including <laughs> literally the best of us, Score. Kitty <laughs> Mokoff one hit away, one stand K away. Oh, no. Wait a minute. Oh, oh there it is. Oh, oh he went. Oh, Diddy Mokov with 3-0 over score to find himself in the winner's side of Grand Finals. Wow. Diddy Mokov.